Roles of ICT in Education The integration of information and communication technology, ICT, in education has transformed the teaching and learning landscape. ICT serves multiple roles, contributing significantly to pedagogical strategies, learning environments, and administrative functions. It enhances the efficiency of educational delivery, fosters student engagement, and provides new opportunities for collaboration and accessibility. Over the years, ICT has evolved from simple digital tools to sophisticated learning platforms, making education more inclusive, flexible, and data-driven. The role of ICT in education extends beyond traditional classroom instruction. It acts as a bridge between educators and students, breaking geographical and economic barriers. Online learning platforms, digital textbooks, and virtual simulations have provided students with enriched learning experiences that were previously unimaginable. With the increasing integration of artificial intelligence and automation, education is becoming more personalized, catering to the unique needs and learning paces of individuals. Moreover, ICT enhances teacher productivity by streamlining administrative tasks and enabling real-time assessment and feedback mechanisms. Tools such as automated grading systems, student performance analytics, and learning management systems help educators focus more on instruction and student development rather than manual paperwork. This shift not only improves efficiency, but also ensures that learning remains at the center of educational efforts. In addition, ICT plays a crucial role in fostering collaborative and interactive learning. The rise of online discussion forums, video conferencing, and cloud-based projects allow students to work together across different locations, cultivating teamwork and communication skills. Gamification and digital storytelling have also emerged as effective strategies to make learning more engaging and enjoyable for students of all levels. Another critical role of ICT is in lifelong learning and skill development. The availability of online courses, open educational resources, and digital certifications allows individuals to continuously upskill and reskill, making education accessible beyond formal schooling years. This aspect is particularly relevant in the modern job market, where technological advancements demand continuous learning and adaptability. Finally, ICT supports inclusive education by catering to diverse learning needs. Assistive technologies, such as screen readers for visually impaired students and speech-to-text software for those with disabilities, ensure that all learners can access educational content equitably. The global shift towards digital education has opened doors for students in remote and underserved areas, giving them the opportunity to receive quality education regardless of their circumstances. Uses of ICT in Education Multiple teaching functions, ICT serves as an essential tool in diverse teaching methodologies. It can be utilized for drill and practice exercises, problem-solving tasks, and accessing extensive information across various subject areas. Teachers can use educational applications and platforms to reinforce lessons, assess student learning, and provide real-time feedback. Diverse teaching and learning modes ICT supports various instructional methodologies such as interactive classroom learning, network learning, independent learning, and managed learning. These modes enhance students' engagement and cater to different learning styles, fostering inclusivity and learner participation. Through learning management systems, LMS, such as Google Classroom, Moodle, and Blackboard, students can access educational content anytime, anywhere, making learning more flexible and adaptable to individual needs. Instantaneous Information Delivery The Internet allows educators and students to access and disseminate information on a global scale at a lower cost. Online research databases, educational videos, and scholarly articles enhance the depth and breadth of instructional materials, ensuring that students receive the most up-to-date and credible information. Education in the Industrial Revolution The Industrial Revolution marked a significant transformation in education, paralleling the technological advancements that reshaped society. 
As industries grew and economies expanded, the demand for an educated workforce increased, leading to major developments in formal education systems. First Industrial Revolution, 18th to 19th century, the introduction of mechanization and factories necessitated basic literacy and numeracy. Education became more structured, with schools focusing on reading, writing, and arithmetic to prepare individuals for industrial jobs. The rise of printing technology also allowed for the mass production of books, making education more accessible. Second Industrial Revolution, 19th to 20th century. Advances in electricity and communication systems led to the expansion of public education. The establishment of compulsory schooling laws ensured that children received a formal education. During this period, blackboards, printed textbooks, and early scientific laboratories became integral to the learning process. Third Industrial Revolution, 20th Century, Present The advent of computers, automation, and digital communication revolutionized education. The introduction of calculators, television-based learning, and early personal computers provided more interactive and efficient teaching methods. Schools began adopting digital tools to enhance instructional delivery and student engagement. Fourth Industrial Revolution, 21st Century Present, characterized by artificial intelligence, big data, the Internet of Things, IoT, and virtual learning environments. The modern era of education embraces highly digitalized and personalized learning. Smart classrooms, virtual reality simulations, and AI-driven tutoring systems are now key components of education, ensuring that learning is more adaptive and data-driven. Evolution of ICT in Education The progression of ICT in education has shaped how information is delivered and absorbed. Below is a timeline highlighting key developments in educational technology. 1650, the horn book, a wooden paddle with printed lessons used in the colonial era, primarily for teaching alphabets and religious verses. It marked one of the earliest forms of instructional technology. 1820, Difference Engine, designed by Charles Babbage. This computing machine was used for mathematical calculations and printing. This innovation laid the foundation for modern computing devices. 1830, Analytical Engine, also designed by Babbage. This second computing machine executed complex calculations through programmed instructions, introducing the concept of automation in computing. 1870, Magic Lantern A, a precursor to the slide projector, used to project images printed on glass plates, helping educators visually illustrate lessons and engage students more effectively. 1890, Slate and Chalkboards, a revolutionary educational tool that facilitated real-time interaction between teachers and students, still widely used in classrooms today. 1905, Stereoscope, a 3D viewing device used as an educational and entertainment tool that allowed students to visualize complex structures in science and geography. 1920 Radio, introduced on-air education, allowing remote students access to lessons. It was particularly useful in reaching rural and underserved areas. 1925, Film Projector, projected moving images to aid instruction, enabling students to learn through visual storytelling and recorded demonstrations. 1930, Overhead Projector, initially a military training tool, later adopted in schools for visual presentations, improving teacher-student interaction through transparent slides. 1950 mimeograph machines allowed teachers to reproduce materials for mass distribution, an essential tool before the advent of digital printing. 1970s, 1980s, personal computers, the introduction of personal computers, such as the Apple II and IBM PC, revolutionized education, allowing students to interact with digital tools and software for learning. 2020s, AI, VR, and smart classrooms, artificial intelligence, AI, personalizes learning experiences, virtual reality, VR, creates immersive simulations, and cloud-based systems streamline educational administration and remote learning. Roles and functions of ICT in education. 
Computers as part of ICT play a significant role in our life. In modern society, computers have become an essential part of everyday life, shaping how we work, communicate, and learn. In the context of education, their influence is profound, enabling students, teachers, and administrators to perform a variety of tasks more effectively and efficiently. Computers have changed many aspects of our lives, especially in the field of education. Computers have revolutionized how education is delivered, making learning more interactive, engaging, and accessible. They allow for instant access to information, provide innovative tools for teaching and learning, and promote collaboration among students and teachers. Roles and Functions of ICT in Education Computers can increase productivity. Computers streamline various administrative and educational processes, enabling both teachers and students to work faster and more efficiently. Teachers can automate tasks like grading, attendance tracking, and lesson planning, while students can complete assignments, research, and communicate with ease, ultimately boosting overall productivity. Computers facilitate communication between students, teachers, and administrators. Through email, messaging platforms, and online forums, computers enable seamless communication among students, teachers, and administrators. This enhances the learning experience by allowing for quick feedback, real-time collaboration, and the sharing of resources. Additionally, it bridges geographic barriers, supporting distance learning and virtual classrooms. Computers are used to access large amounts of information. With the internet and digital resources, computers offer access to a wealth of information on virtually any topic. This allows students to conduct research, expand their knowledge, and engage with current, diverse materials that support their studies, thus enhancing learning opportunities. Computers are brilliant aids in teaching. Computers support the use of multimedia tools, such as presentations, simulations, and educational games, making lessons more engaging and dynamic. Teachers can incorporate videos, animations, and interactive elements into their lessons to better explain complex concepts and cater to different learning styles. Computers facilitate an electronic format for storage of information. Rather than relying on physical storage, Computers allow for the digital organization and storage of vast amounts of information. This not only saves space, but also makes it easier to access, update, and share materials, whether they are lesson plans, student records, or research findings. Computers can teach subjects and enhance learning for the students. In addition to supporting teachers, computers can serve as independent learning tools. Educational software, ebooks, and online courses provide students with interactive and personalized learning experiences that can enhance their understanding of subjects, encourage self-paced learning, and improve retention. The computer is teacher's tool, an information tool. Computers are powerful tools for accessing, organizing, and presenting information. Teachers can use them to prepare and deliver lessons, access teaching resources, and gather data for assessments. This makes lesson planning and content delivery more efficient. A communication tool. Computers enable teachers to communicate with students, colleagues, and parents quickly and effectively. Through email, chat, video calls, and collaborative platforms, teachers can stay connected with everyone involved in the educational process, ensuring smooth communication. A constructive tool. Computers act as constructive tools by allowing teachers and students to create content. Teachers can design interactive lessons and activities, while students can create projects, presentations, and reports. This encourages creativity, critical thinking, and problem-solving skills. As a co-constructive tool When used as a co-constructive tool, computers allow both teachers and students to collaborate on the creation of knowledge. A situating tool. Computers also function as situating tools by providing contextual and real-world applications for the material being taught.